Hey, this is Barry. So you've probably seen this TikTok video and this kind of stuff goes viral. As you can see, this has had over 220,000 views. And the way to do this is basically you go to Clone AI and then you download it. And then what you need to do is you need to obviously subscribe with a subscription. So the suggested would be 9 99 a month, for example. Now, just to be aware, there might still be a limit on how many videos you can do per month. I think it was around 34. Somebody put in a comment previously. I haven't reached that limit, so I can't guarantee that. But make sure you check that out if that's something that you're concerned about. And obviously, getting the full access will allow you to not have any watermarks. But if you just wanted to try it, you could exit out and then literally give it a shot. So if I just go back into the app again, and I'm just going to load it, clone AI, you'll see I've got that back. So what I'm just going to do is actually restore it on here because I've already become a member. So at the bottom, you can see all of these different effects that you've got. You've got styles at the bottom and you've got deforum. And deforum is that example that's used here. And as you can see, you can change the styles. So, for example, if we just wanted to do a style, and this is really cool because it gives you a bit of an idea of what it would be like if you did this versus what the effect is. So I'm going to click on Start. Okay, there you go. So you've got a 50 credits limit for 30 days. So I can actually purchase that because I do want to show you how to do this. So I'm just going to get this through real, real quick now. Let me just do that. There we go. Okay, so that's fifteen pounds I've just spent. Never mind. So you've got the various different effects that you want to do. As you can see, that's the original. That's the effect, and you literally just slide it as you want to. But for example, I don't want to do that one. I want to do Joker. Okay, so I'm going to click Start, click Next access all of my photos and that will then go to my camera. So I'm going to give access to my camera, switch this round and then this is me here. So I'm literally just going to do one now of a photo. There you go. Use photo. That'll then bring it up into the gallery and then it'll actually start doing that for you straight away. So obviously that was just a picture. That's the image there. Obviously, if you decide to do a video instead, we can do that as well. If you want to save, you click on the top right and you can remove the watermark by selecting the bottom. As you can see, it flickers. You can also change the style to have your original picture there or verses or side by side. So that's one way to do it. And you click save to photos and that's a photo literally saved. Now let's try and import a video this time and let's try a different one. So I'm going to try Alien, okay? Now this will take a bit more time. So I'm going to click on off that first of all and cancel because I want to start a new one. Oh no, it hasn't remembered it. Bear with me, quit. Close that, go back. Okay, fine. So we're going to start a new one here. I'll try Silver Robot this time. We're going to import a video, as you can see, I've been doing some here. So literally just this one. So this is what I've done. <laughs> there you go. I click done at the top right and then it'll start converting that video. Now, personally, there, there are stable diffusion models and, and that kind of thing. But for me, I just found that the settings, the parameters was quite, quite complex. It was on Google Collabs. There's different options, but I do find the app far more easier to use. Uh, obviously, if you want more settings, then you might want to go down that route instead of just this app. Because as you've seen, there's pretty much default options. You've only got a limited amount of default options and effects that you can actually choose to do this. Now, what can be useful while it's doing this is, as you can see, it's letting you know how long this is going to take until it's finished. But what you can do at the bottom, you've got enable notifications. So you can turn your device off and it will notify you in the pop up notifications just to let you know that that's actually finished. Now, this is the effect that I've produced. See, I really like that. I think that's amazing. So I'm going to pause it again. Top right. Remove the watermark. There's also an effect 
called Enable Deflicker. Just makes it a bit of a smoother transition. And again, you've got the options at the bottom or you can just save two photos. So that is how the video is. Now if I go back to the home screen, go back, at the bottom, you've also got the forum, and this is the viral TikTok. Yes. You can actually do so. You've got creatures, mm, you quite, quite creatures. You've got cosmic for things like space. But I'm going to try magical. So I'm going to click on start, and I really like how it allows you to preview them. I think it's really cool to see that. So I'm going to select the video that I've just produced with that effect. I'm going to click done. And then obviously this is going to take a while now. So this is going to take 14 minutes. So I'll be back in a second when it's ready. Okay, so that's just finished and I'll just play it now. <laughs> I thought that was great if you like cats but as I say you've got uh, various degrees of control with this and you've only got those deforum styles and these typical styles to choose from so they might be uh, putting new ones going forward so that's something to bear in mind as well hope you like this video please subscribe if you're interested in all things AI related and um, musician related NFTs web3 etc take care thanks bye